What's up? Daphne Lane here, and welcome back to another Let's Play episode. I am hard at work right now, uh, working on the castle. I've got a lot done. Please don't blow up on me. Oh my gosh, dude, no. Oh, creepers. Creepers drive me insane. Insane and sad. I just actually cre uh, made like three golems. Unfortunately, they don't attack creepers. Um, so I need to get a cat. I really do. I'm gonna need to get some grass blocks over here eventually so I can fix this mess. Grr. Alright, let me just clean all this up. Anyways, back to the introduction. Alright guys, so I have been working really hard on the castle. You guys can see so much progress has gone in. Um, it's gone into it. Right now, I'm getting, um, getting some of this walkway done. Um... Yeah, gotta get the rest of this roof done. But let me just show you guys what I'm replicating, pretty much. Um, because what I did on this side is I've got all of this done. Completo. Look at these golems. They're way over there wrecking people. Alright, so in here I have the nice little walkway. And if you continue to walk this way, let's go up these little stairs here. Hopefully no mobs have spawned up here. Alright, we're good. Alright, so you have this nice little walkway overlooking the courtyard. Or I guess you would call it a courtyard of the castle. Um, and I'm thinking like right in the center over here guys Or maybe over here. Actually, this would be better. I'm actually gonna build a guillotine <laughs> I think a guillotine would be pretty cool. I mean, whoops, hello mob crush. I don't want to mob crush stream right now, please Um, but anyways I mean, <laughs> I think it'll be pretty awesome. I mean to have a guillotine over here I mean, it may be a little bit dark for some people, but I think it's gonna be pretty accurate in a castle build. I mean, the most of them I've, I've noticed have them, or they're somewhere. All right, so I'm gonna come over here really quick. I need some food pretty bad. I don't really have any food on me. Um, hunger has been definitely a problem for me so far with the update because I've been forgetting to eat. Let me just go ahead and just munch on this really quick. All right, let's get some protein in us. All right, there we go. Um. But yeah, we're going to go ahead and I'm going to finish finish up as much of the build as I can um, today with you guys. I'm not going to do the entire episode for me just building. Um, but then we're going to go down and I'm going to show you guys um, part of the, the lab. I went ahead and... <clears throat> no! Grr! Darn that freaking bug. That mining bug where you're running. And it freaking... It'll mine something up no matter what's in your hand. Um, anyways, last episode, we went to the nether, and I had a lot of permission from you guys. Like, you, I didn't even ask for permission. A lot of you suggested, you know, because I did find the dead spawners. Um, I did, you know, I did, <clears throat> fair and square, I did find a nether fortress. However, the spawners were dead. And you guys were like, well, you know, what you could do is go into creative and then spawn some in. I mean, obviously, the, the, the spawners are there. They were just broken. Um, but to put in some blaze spawners myself. So, I went ahead and did that, guys. I did go into creative mode. I didn't even think about that, to be honest. Like, I was like, well, I guess I'm going to have to find another one. But you guys are like, you know, suggested that to me. And because I had you guys' permission, I went ahead and did it. Um, I went into creative mode. And um, I didn't know, but, like, if you go, like, <clears throat> let's say you have inventory is full of stuff like if I was to go into creative mode right now and then try to switch back to survival I lose everything and I didn't know that and so like all of my tools that I had before that I had my first enchants like I lost everything I like wanted to cry like all my enchanted stuff was gone so this is slice and easy too I had my first sword that I had it was like it was a crappy enchant anyway it was like sharpness one but I named it slice and easy Anyways, in Memorance, this is slice and easy too, except it's an axe. Um, it's going to kind of, it's going to have two, purpose, two purposes. It's going to be my tool, and then it's also going to be a good, uh, a good uh, mob, mob killer. Um, but anyways, um, let's go ahead and get into this. I think, I feel like I'm talking too much right now, and I'm just going to get right into the build today. So, yeah, let's go ahead and jump right into it. Alright, I'm working on the roof right now. Let me just see. Um, but like I said, I've been doing a lot of off, uh, off recording building and I mean, obviously if I don't, I mean, it'll never, not that it'll never get done, but it's going to take so long. And, um, I did tell you guys, <clears throat> actually, I don't know if I did tell you guys, but I will have another world download in episode 50 and that's only like two episodes away. So I want to get this castle 
<clears throat> Excuse me, guys. I'm so sorry. I don't know if I'm getting sick. I hope not. Um, but anyways, episode 50, I'll have that download for you guys. And I want to just make sure that I have as much of the castle completed for you guys. So that it's, you know, going to be looking nice. Nice and pretty. Alright, so I have 28. I'm going to need more than that. Wait, what am I crafting? Please don't craft the wrong thing. Earlier today, oh man, I almost cried. I had so much iron on me, and I was like, well, I'm going to make some iron golems. I had initially had enough just to make, like, I like, think it was like three or four. And, you know, obviously, you know, you need nine ingots for, um, yeah, you need nine ingots just for one uh, block of iron. And I didn't know that if you just keep crafting without paying attention, you'll craft up, like, anvils. I now, I now have, like, seriously, no joke, I think I have like, three extra anvils. Three extra! And I was, I was so mad, I was like, what in the world? You're like, how would that, how would that happen? Only, actually, you know what, only that would happen to me. That's, that's usually how that works. Um, <clears throat> let's see. I believe I'm building that correctly. I just want to, uh, to say huge thanks to you guys, um, for supporting this series, of course, since the new update came out. Um, I feel like I have a lot more support in the Let's Play. You guys are just, um, more excited to see them. And I'm, I'm just more excited to make them, to be honest. Like, um, it's just, it's been a blast so far. And I just want to say thank you guys so much for, for all the support. And I'm about to run out of blocks again. Dang it. Oh, man. I'm just gonna have to craft up everything that I have. Ouch. Alright, I am just finishing up the last bits here, and then we're going to go into uh, to working on the nether farm, because I have like nine nether wart. Um, I have nine, so we really need to get a farm going so we can get some growing and stuff, so we can actually enchant some potions. Because we all know, you know, of course, the base formula for every potion is awkward, and to make awkward potions, you need um, nether wart. So I really need to to get our farm going on that. Um, and I think the way I placed... Guys, this is so... This is so confusing to me. Like, I feel like I'm doing something wrong. Is there a golem way over there? I think that's a skeleton. Um, whoops. Forgot to run and jump. Whoops. Alright. Jump back. Alright, so basically, after that, that's done pretty much. Um, I'm going to have to go in and I'm going to show you guys really quick what I did on the other side. Sorry guys, I got kind of far from the mic there. Um, but anyways, I finished up the towers. I didn't really show you guys yet, but I finished up the towers on the in, in each side there, just the front. Um, and then the wall's done. And if you come around here, you can actually see that I finished... The wall on this side as well so it's looking pretty fabulous lots of detail has gone into it I think um, but it's a lot easier than what it looks it, I promise you um, so when once we get that completed the wall will kind of come together in the backdrop there where that big old slice empty slice of nothing um, and then it'll kind of fill in like it did right there so um, again, we'll work on that next time, but I just really wanted to get at least that portion of it done. And then again, I'll have to do the back, but the back won't take too much because this building is pretty much taking up most of the, the spot. If you guys can see, it's just this part right here. Okay, so you guys can pretty much see here is the brewing stand looking fancy as ever. Um, when I went in to go and try and get some blaze rods, I was able to get one. Um, so I went ahead and you guys can see I made some, uh, I believe this is the instant health potion, I believe. Yeah, instant health potion. So I was able to, to craft three of those up. Very easy. Um, of course you guys can see I have nine nether warts. So I'm going to need to make a farm and I'm going to need to make it quick. Um, so that way we don't run out of nether wart, obviously. Alright, so, so far so good. Um... Like I said, I'm gonna. I think I'm gonna do one side. We're gonna go with, um, yeah. One side's gonna be cobble or cobble. <laughs> one side's gonna be nether wart, and then one side's going to be, um, 
mushrooms. So let me go. We got a little staircase here, kind of going down one. And then over here on this side, um, again, it's not going to be super fancy. I mean, it's just a small farm. Now, we can expand it in the future, but for right now, we're just going to leave it nice and, and cozy and small here. Let's go ahead and try placing the sandstone or uh, soul sand, sorry, for the mushrooms. Wait, no, this is not for mushrooms. This is for nether ward. Oh my gosh, I cannot, I cannot speak right today, guys. I'm so sorry. And that's because I had two cups of coffee right before I started recording. That's pretty bad. All right, so I've got them, I've got them split up. Okay, so this side was going to be the nether ward. This side will be uh, mushrooms. I believe mushrooms can grow on anything, basically, as long as it's in the dark. Um, so I'll probably have to remove those torches here soon. So let's go ahead and grab our nether warts. Since we only have nine. Um, so, yeah, let's go. There we go. And let's go ahead and get these babies planted so we can start growing. Yeah, nice. All right. I figured it was time. There we go. We have that going. And then if I remove these torches, I just don't want any, any mobs spawning in here. I'm kind of scared of that. Well, you know what? I'm going to leave this torch here for now. Just for now because, I mean, at the moment... We don't need, um, we don't need mushrooms, I don't believe. Like, I know we need mushrooms for fermented eye, spider eyes, I think. If we're going to make fermented spider eyes, I think it's like sugar and mushrooms. Um, but it's to make, uh, potions of poison, I believe, to do that. But we don't really need that at the moment. Um, we're not going to do any extreme combating or anything like that. We're just, we're just some chill folks right now. Alright, so, this is it for now you know it looks beautiful guys i know that you just love the design and everything <laughs> but for now that's gonna be how it is but um anyways guys that's gonna be pretty much it for today's episode hopefully you guys did enjoy again like i said i mean i really we didn't do a whole bunch but i, I wanted to, to kind of give you some progress update on the castle do a little bit of building with you guys um just to let you guys know that the castle is, is, you know, it's flourishing, it's coming together, and it should be ready by episode 50, I believe. At least 90% done, I think it's going to be looking pretty good. So, we're going to head over, we are going to head over to the Wall of Subbies, and I'm going to show you guys who I added today. Alrighty, so today I added Jackson Savodny, I believe I said that right, and uh, Sasha Vela Cardenas. Thank you so much for all the support, guys, on the videos. And again, thank you guys so much for watching. And as always, I love you all. I'll see you next time. Bye.